My name's Mickey Munoz. I um, first started surfing, I, I think I first stood up in about 1947 or 48, and uh, luckily I'm still standing. I got interested in, in the design of surfboards probably in the very early 50s. And this is the board that I, this is the board. This is a 8-9 uh, stand-up board that's I have pretty high performance, actually really high performance. The art of shaping, you know, to be included in this with some of my gurus who I look up to as shaper designers and I know what has gone into their designs and appreciate it. I feel very honored to be part of it. To be able to try and relay that to the average surfer so that they can get some understanding of how sacred what they are doing is and how lucky they are to be surfers and to have the equipment that's available now. I think for the average surfer, I don't think they realize what goes into a surfboard. The fact that the people who work on boards are, are real artists and artisans. Uh, from start to finish, everything has to be perfect. Because if it's imperfect, usually that imperfection then gets carried through the process. To correct a mistake is much more difficult. I'm so lucky to be a designer shaper because there's no, no end to it. I mean, we're constantly developing new stuff and that's the hook. It's what keeps you in it. I still run down the water hooting and laughing and giggling. Can't wait.